Hi. Hey. Hey. We have a last minute yeah. mission. Hi, David Kay. Hey. Here he is. Here he is. My guy. Oh boy, oh boy. That's uh you guys are you guys are uh relentless out there. <laughs> it's awesome. Isn't that great? Yeah. Oh, wow. It's, uh, how great is this? Uh, it's, I didn't realize Sue was uh, going to be here until, uh, I think, uh, yesterday. Is that right? Yeah, I, I didn't realize. Uh, I don't pay attention to social media too much. Yeah. I'm supposed to. Um, uh, but yeah, I realized, that, oh my god, you're here. I was thrilled when I saw David oh. Kay was going to be here. Because you know, she's really a big part of why I'm even involved with, with oh. the animated. I mean, I remember I sent you an email. Hey, do you think I could read from me? <laughs> um, I was still living in Canada at that time. Yeah. We hadn't, hadn't uh, emigrated yet. And uh, yeah, that was, uh, so, and Sue was there at the beginning of the, I did a you know, couple cartoons before and then the, and this thing happened. And, uh, and Sue was behind the glass. It was the, the most joyful few years of my life, I think, uh, to this day. And I still, we still keep in touch. There's a few people I haven't been in touch with, but we still, are on text threads and still keep in touch with someone. Uh, Absolutely. Yeah. I watch you all the time Gosh. on Facebook. Uh, yeah, I, I, th- <laughs> I, I knew he was the one, mm. you know, when, especially when you came to LA, especially that we could get you in that role. Yeah, that was, I always think it was, I was the, it's the meerkat thing that happens when it's an act when you're behind the glass and you, you see, when you're reading, you know, and, and, and the energy you can read. And all of a sudden, uh, you had me go out. You had me leave the room and, and try Optimus. And I'm like, what? Uh, okay. <laughs> Optimus. <laughs> you know, so I went out and grabbed the sides and then came back in. And it was uh, Marty Eisenberg. It was Derek Wyatt. Uh, we were all, you guys were all behind the glass. Yeah. And, and I started just doing my thing, kind of basic, my own voice. You mentioned that, uh, that, that Tom... Uh, 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 the actor, um, um, oh my god, I've got a mental block. I'm tired. Uh, Tom Hanks type type of the thing you were looking for, and right. and I, I noticed like the heads like meerkats kind of popped up, and they started looking, you know, like you know, meerkats come out of the ground, and I, I go, <laughs> oh, something's going on in there, you know, and that's when I uh, thought the possibility was, and even uh, just to quickly to wrap this up, I was driving through Chinatown, and when Natanya called me and said, "Hey, so they want to they want to hire you for for uh, Transformers," I go, "Oh, awesome!" I'm thinking, oh, "Megatron's back! Here we go again! All right, right. the old gangs to get." And then she so the for Optimus Prime, and I went, I, I literally said, "Are you, what? Are you sure?" <laughs> She's yeah. <laughs> she didn't really know my history with Megatron at that time. I guess not. And I, and I said, "You sure? Are you sure they they?" They're, she said, yeah, what's the wrong? I said, oh, I'm just surprised. <laughs> so he's done, done yeah. both the, the, the bad guy and the good guy. Yeah, it's weird. No? It's great. Yeah, so thank you. Love you. And Love it's great you. To see you. Thank you. All right. Uh, we were in the middle of some questions, apparently. Hello? Hello. Hello. First of all, I want to say it's really nice to meet you two. I've been big fans of both of you, and I can't tell you how happy I am to see both of you in the same room. And I feel like I got kind of lucky because when David Kay came here and started like talking about all this stuff, I feel like I, I, I technically cheated. I'm technically in, in the front row since I was waiting for him to be <laughs> talking. So that was, that, was, that was a nice surprise. But I do have a question originally for Sue, but now uh-huh. that David's here, is it okay if I ask two questions or am I only asking for one question? No, I asked two. Oh, no, perfect. Yeah, Okay, so my, my first question for Sue is that you've been uh, the voice of RC in, mo- in more than one Transformers media, like the G1 and Animated, that's where I first saw you, and you've also been the voice director for, for, for several shows, and uh, you're also like, uh, what's the name, Transmute, but my main question for you is like, when you, as, as a voice director, like what's your, uh, how do you go about directing yourself when you play a character? Um. I, it, usually the producer and the writers are there and they're very familiar with the role. So I'll go in and, and say, have at it, guys. You know, go ahead and direct me. Oh, okay. If But, yeah, I kind of direct myself, but then they'll give me direction also. Uh-huh. And I'll wait until the end of the show to go in and then do my lines. 
Because well, I always been, that was my biggest question for you for a long time. I was wanted to ask you that. Did but, I answer it? Yes, you did. Okay. <laughs> I appreciate that. And second question. <laughs> yeah, for for David, that uh, you played multiple characters in Transformers animated, including Optimus Prime, Love Nut, and Grimlock. And uh, I just wanted to ask, like, out of all those three, which character was your favorite to voice in that show? <laughs> That's a tough question. I mean, I'm going to say, you know, that the boring answer they all are, because I'm 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 just thrilled to get to get I get a chance to do it, but. Um, I always had a, like, I, I love them all, but I always had a soft spot for Lugnut because, uh, <laughs> and it, <laughs> these are guys, look at me, I'm over here, I'm really the guy who's running things, you know, and, and it's, uh, the fact that he was inducted into the, <laughs> into the Hall of Fame, into the Hall, I didn't know that until recently either, it's like, what, Lugnut, yeah, shut up, that's awesome. <laughs> And, and, and I think he's just such a lovable oaf, you know, uh, and uh, will do anything for Megatron blindly. <laughs> so I think it's very cool that uh, Lugnut gets his due. So, yeah. I always saw him as like animates like own version of Inferno from Beast Wars. He was just as <laughs> yeah. loyal. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Thank I you. It's nice thank to meet you. You, you too. Cheers. Cheers.